Hey guys, what's up? Laser here, and before I begin, I'm going to go ahead and forewarn you that this first part of this video is incredibly boring. Uh, it's pretty retarded, because I decided I was going to go ahead and start using target finders. Me and my friends have found a sort of like a camping formula, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go on uh, more about that later on whenever we upload the video about it. But uh, it's kind of fun, and... Um, Basically, I've been wanting to upload a video about target finders uh, for a very long time now because I hate target finders. Uh, it I, that is the I think it is probably the most retarded addition to Call of Duty, as if somebody actually needed something to help them point and aim their guns. I, I mean, I mean, think about it. If you suck so bad that you need a machine to help you shoot the gun. This isn't Call of Duty anymore. What what is this? I mean, uh, if you have an attachment that sh that, sh that shows you, hey, point the gun here, shoot here. That's retarded. You know, wh where's the skill involved in that? Literally, what I'm doing right now, I'm just aiming down the sights and looking down the stairwell. Is literally what guys do. Uh, I I'm losing the game for pretty much the entirety of this of this match. And at the very end, I win the game. For no reason at all, just because I'm using a stupid target finder. All target finders are to me are advanced wall hacks. I remember back on Hijack, uh, we used to, the guys used to sit there and, and camp before they did the patch, and they would be able to look through the walls at some points when they were using their, uh, their target finders. And that's a huge disadvantage to guys who are, are trying to get kill streaks and everything. I'm just noobs in general because the first thing a noob does when he gets on this game is oh I want to play Call of Duty okay so what kind of guns are whoa he can aim in and the gun tells him where to shoot that's awesome and then what happens you get five or six little kids running around with target finders and I mean what we're all gonna put cold-blooded on no we shouldn't have to do that you know that's that's ultimately retarded dude uh, target finder is really dangerous uh, on any kind of gun, but it is particularly dangerous on um, light machine guns and um, light machine guns. <laughs> it, it's, that's pretty much the most dangerous thing it's on. I mean, guys with the light machine gun will literally just stand there and aim down the sights, and they will just keep shooting until you walk up in there. I'm using the hammer with it right now, and I'm telling you guys right now, it is a beast. I mean, it, it, it is it is crucial. My KD was a three when I left, and this is a free for all. You know, th this is this is a beast, guys. And if you want to try it out, I might put the class in the description. I might not, depending on how mean I'm feeling after I do the video. But uh, this is a completely overpowered class. I hate the target finder. It's definitely one of my least favorite things about the game, if not my least favorite thing. Um, it, it you shouldn't you know unless you are absolutely mentally retarded. You don't need something to help you aim in on the game because you haven't needed that in the last in, in the past four or five games online. You do not need a target finder. And to say, oh, it's just a neat little thing they added. You know, that's just not fair to me. You know, I, I don't I don't think that it's neat at all. I'm actually I actually think it's kind of a cheating kind of thing because I mean if. If some guys that throw some guys throw smoke or whatever, you know, and you're saying, oh, well, they're using smoke, so I'm gonna use a target finder. Well, what about the thermal? We use thermal attachments, you know, and those were cool. Those were gay on the last games, but people still use them. And you know, hey, everyone, nobody mind a thermal, but you know, we gotta use the target finder now. You know, what is this? What is this? An arcade game? We shoot the ducks? I mean, come on, man. You gotta have some kind of skill involved. You know, it's gotta be it's gotta be hard for some people. I mean, if you gotta you've gotta work on your on your skills to aim in. You gotta work on your skills to aim in. Bottom line. But anyway, that's pretty much all I have to say about. It. I'm not gonna stretch it out. But hey, have you guys ever had a friend like uh, like I want to talk about this? Like I used to have a friend, and I still I still am good friends with this person. But have you ever had a friend that was? kind of stolen by another friend. I don't want to say stolen because I mean, I don't want to I, you know, I don't want to be a mean girl here and say that nobody can be friends with anybody, you know, with any of my friends, you know. But, you know, I've had this friend for a long time and we really like to do stuff together and everything. And then all of a sudden, uh, 
I guess over the summer and everything, you know, he's out doing all this awesome stuff, and I stay home and play Call of Duty. And then he meets these, uh, this other guy, you know. I mean, he we, we both knew this other guy, you know, and... Nah, this sounds gay. But anyway, we we knew this other person. And um, have you ever had that friend who just keeps getting taken away from you by that other person? You know, like these guys, you know, they both have money and, you know, I don't. And so, you know, they, they roll around in these fancy, awesome cars and stuff. And then, you know, I pull up in my my truck. Now, don't get me wrong. You know, I love my truck. But I pull up and they're like, oh, God, look at that guy's truck. Uh, yeah. Hey, dude, we're going to go to McDonald's. Um, we're all going to ride in this car. You can follow us in your truck if you want. Just make sure you stay two cars behind or three so you don't. I mean, <laughs> I mean, really, I mean, they walk up wearing their Hollister and stuff, and, you know, and I don't wear Hollister, you know, I. I guess I wear Levi and stuff like that, you know, and they're like, oh, God, you know, look at this guy, you know. You know, I, you know, I just make me, you know, I don't I don't care, but, I mean, if I was a little kid or something, you know, I'd feel really bad, you know, and, and I actually feel bad that I never get a chance to spend time with my friend anymore, you know, that really, that really bugs me, you know, a lot, you know, and I'm saying, you know, if you really have to, like, purposely try to make other fe people feel bad about, uh, you know, and, and try to keep them away from people they've known for a long time. You know, that's gotta suck. You know, and and I, and I'm now now that I I used to make fun of like you know all these Disney Channel shows that I used to watch. You know, you know, oh wow, he, he's her friend's getting taken away. You know, oh his friend is is hanging out with other people. You know, but I mean, hey, now I kind of realize it kind of sucks a little bit now. You know, and this guy, this person was my best friend. You know. And, uh, we just really don't hang out that much, you know, I, you know, it's kind of sad, you know, but I, 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 hopefully, hopefully we can pick it up, you know, sometime, you know, maybe I can go and murder that kid or something, and, you know, then we have a lot of more time to hang out, you know. So guys, if this video was, uh, entertaining, uh, at all, I don't think it'd help you. I hope it didn't help, because if I see you guys running around target finders, I will hack your accounts. So guys, I am going to roll out. Uh, it's really late right now, and I'm really freaking tired, and I have some tests to do. So, peace out. Please subscribe. And until next time, I'm done.